to the pump or into the, the pool is suction. The, the lines are equally filled. So in order for one line to go up, it would suck this water. If in order for the other line, it would suck this water. So that's what keeps the, the whole system full of, of water. It is no air in the system. Yeah. Um, so are we going to have to pump this thing after it's full? When it's full, you should be able to turn it on. This, does this have water in it? Yeah. It, um, more than likely, you'll have to take the garden hose and just keep this thing full yeah. until you work the air bubble out of it. Right, right. And then you put that lid on. Okay, gotcha. But to change out the filter so you don't get soaked because this thing is full all the way up to here. Right. You would open this valve. Hear the air yeah. that's in there? Once that's done, you take this, either a screwdriver through here or a big pair of channel locks and loosen it, okay? okay. Uh -huh. And let the, the water from Drain here of empty there. down. All you have to do is get down below about to right, here and then right. you can shut it. Then this has little release levers in here uh -huh. that lock right. that in place. You push those in and unscrew it. Uh -huh. And now, you if you didn't empty this, the minute you popped this loose... I didn't empty it, did you? No, I said if you, if you didn't empty it by right. opening this yeah, up yeah, and, yeah. and loosening that, when you go to pull this lid off, you'd get drenched because all this would be Did you already water. loosen up the bottom one? I didn't loosen the bottom one up because there all wasn't. the water should have drained down this way. But oh, okay. I can grab a pair of pliers just to make sure. Thank you. It, it there. Yeah. When you emptied the hot tub, all the water. There we go. So there's no filter in there. There's no filter in it. I wonder what happened to the filter. So there's that. Now, when you go to change this filter, this may come up with it. Uh huh. Um, Make sure you keep it put down. Put your thumb down. And it says on the filter, this side up, okay. push firmly. Uh, the filter's kind of at a wedge, so you need to push it down. Make sure it's right okay. around there. Okay. This thing goes back on here. And I'm going to put some lubricant around this, some more lubricant, so it slides in and off for you. Vaseline, it looks like it, but it's called magic lube and ironically it's made by Aladdin okay um, no I don't make it it's a different company but oh. it's it's actually silicone that doesn't dry okay good so it it works great as a lubricant and it actually rejuvenates the seal the seals and makes them swell up believe it or not if you take like o-rings that are flattened yeah. and smashed up if you sit, take them in the house and put them in vegetable oil to soak them overnight they they'll puff actually up. Swell back up. Cool. This thing, you just put it back into place, turn it, and it should lock into place. Good deal. Then that is as tight as it needs to be. Okay. And then you said when I fill it up and fire everything up that I should open that bottom thing. Will you show me how that opens? Um, this is going to be, here's another O-ring, but this is a swimming pool pump. Right. So you need to take the garden hose and first fill up the hot tub. Right, right. Then have the garden hose here because this is the suction. Right. It pushes it out through here, but they've got a bypass. So if the filter's not circulating too much, it can go over here back to the heater. But if you just fill this up, water is going to boop right down through right, that and give you an air to air. Yeah. Once it starts running, then you put the lid on. Um, no, but once it starts running, then I put the hose in there, right? Um, or I put the hose in first. Fill it up and put the hose in put first. The, and put then the hose in or fill up the hot tub. Then fill this up as much as you can. Okay. And then, and then put the lid on. on, turn the pump on, and see if it... Okay. You're, you're gonna Because you've got an air bubble in there. Right, it's going to And what's going to happen is it's going to suck the water, empty this water here that's in here. It's going to empty it out. And then it's not going to pump anymore because a pump is like a yeah, siphon. Right, it's right. Si if it gets an air bubble in it, it 